Welcome to another YouTube Force Scan video. Today we're going to enable Secure Idle. What Secure Idle does is, if you have the key fob with you, turn the car on. Sorry. Let's turn the truck on. Alright. I can obviously change gears by holding the brake. Right? But if the key is not here, I'm going to just chunk the keys over there. Right? Push the brake. Since the truck is already on, you can still move it. Right? You can still engage all the gears. So a secure, uh, what secure idle does is while the truck is idling on if the keys are not present it's not going to let you let you change the gears all right so we're going to start with the obd2 connection the elm 327 to the obd2 connection all the way in always keep it down and plug this in over here and turn the truck on just on power mode All right, we're plugged in. Now we're going to open force scan. And read the warning signs here. There's a mouse. All right, then we're going to go down here to where it says connect. Read the warning signs, which is make sure the ignition is on. It's set up on H and the vehicle's not moving. So it found a truck, same profile as before. Same exact truck I've been using. Do we have a high and medium? Yes, we do. We're going to flip the switch down here to medium and hit okay. So let everything load. Now it says ready on the bottom. So we're going to click on configurations and this configuration is actually on the body control module right here. Okay. So we're going to click on the little play button here to run it. And we have to switch this to high. Read the warnings. Let all the blocks load. All right, so we're going into seven twenty six forty two one. That's pretty far down. There it is, seven twenty six forty two one. All right, double check to make sure we're clicking on the right one. 726-42-01. All right, so we're looking at these. All right, so that second digit, a zero, is to unenable. We're going to switch that zero to a one. We'll enable it. We're going to click on right. Are you sure? Read the warnings. Everything flashed on and off. It says this was successful. We're going to click OK. Power off. Let, let the truck cycle off. Let's turn it back on now. Actually, let's go ahead and turn the truck on. All right, have the key still. Let's see if it worked. I'm gonna throw these keys out the window. Now I'm gonna try to change gears. Still worked. 
All right, so actually I just had to move the keys further out. They were about 15, 20 feet away and I, it was too, too close. So I moved them way out there close to my door. And now the truck is on, brake is on. It will not change gears. Right away it says no key detected. Right. So thanks for watching guys. Make sure to subscribe and like the video, comment, and let me know what other videos you'd like to see. Um, thanks again for watching. Right, check out some of these other videos I got also.